Hello. Hello. How are you both today? I'm good. Great. How are you How doing? Are you? Very good, thank you. You know, to start off, I have to ask, what is it like when you're filming and you get these gigantic stars on the stage with these gigantic fans? Is it, it is there a little bit of chaos or does it all just run smoothly because they're on their best behavior? What is that like? No, it, it's 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 poetic chaos. You know, there is this this beautiful wildness that happens um, all under the roof of the super fan and we love it because to be honest we're not keeping our cool either like that's the big secret you know like i'm sitting there i got my fresh outfit on got my microphone kelty's in the vip area Woo! doing her thing looking yeah. glam as usual and then the artist comes out and we meet at the middle of the stage and in my head i'm thinking keep your cool keep your cool yeah, keep yeah. your cool don't lose your cool yeah. because we want a super fan out as well. And, and to be honest, during the episode, we did. We did. Yeah. And that's what makes this show special. You've covered half my questions because my, <laughs> my other side of this is exactly that. that you're, you're both pros at this, but like to be standing beside LL Cool J right. and Shania Twain. Right. Like, how do you how do you keep your cool? <laughs> and did you get a moment with them at all off off screen? Well, here's the great thing. So I'm Canadian. I grew up on Shania Twain. She is like the queen of my life. Um, I'm even like an early, early records people don't know Shania Twain fan. And so, you know, it was very humbling and wonderful because we called her, you know, we called her to say, hey, will you do the show? And she was like, I know you're a real fan and I know you're going to do right by me and I know the show's going to be great. And so the fact that she agreed to come on and then being in the room with her that day, she's complimenting our outfit. She's asking where the boots are from. Like we had so much fun with her, but I'll tell you something. I barely kept my cool. I do host the show with like two octaves higher than my normal speaking voice just because I was so excited. But I tell you something that was really cool. The stars had so much fun doing the show. After every single show, they would turn to Nate and I and they'd be like, come back to my trailer. Let's let's take it. Let's have a yeah. celebratory drink. That never happens when you interview celebrities. They're already like, I'm out. I, I did my job. On to the next thing. We were taking shots with Pitbull in his trailer. Yeah. Shania Twain. We had a champagne toast. I mean, they were so happy and the show put them in such a good mood. Now, think about that for a second. Like, listen, I, I pride myself on being a true Leo. Like, I'm a lion. I could walk in any room and conquer my jungle. That's how I feel. I'm as cool as ever. You talk to me, I'm going to sit here and give you the flavor. That's just what I do. But when LL and Pitbull and Shania, Kelsey Ballerini, Little Big Town, they're all like, hey, come back to our trailer and let's have some drinks. Outside, I'm like this. Okay, cool. I'll be there in 15 minutes. But inside, I'm like, oh my gosh! <laughs> so, you know, that's what happens. That's what happens when you're on a show like Superfan. What does it take to be a super fan, what do you think it takes? So, you know, listen, to be a super fan, you needed the things that we looked for in these super fans. Right. To win this competition, we put our super fans through many, many, many interviews. They had to prove how well they know the music. Mm -hmm. They have to prove how well they know, you know, the impactful, huge moments of their career, whether yep. it be Grammy Awards or performances or Super Bowls or yep. things like that. They have to think like the star. We have one of yeah. the games that we play is basically you say to LL Cool J, hey, you've collaborated with J-Lo on a bunch of songs. If you had to watch one of Jennifer Lopez's rom-coms, which one would you watch? That's right. not Googleable. You Nobody knows the answer to that. LL didn't even know the answer That means you have to know to the that. personality of the artist in order to think yes. like them. So you have to think like them. You have to match those answers. And then you have to be able to perform like them. We even had a charades uh, well, we had a sh competition. Oh, my God. We had a charades competition for Pitbull. And you had to be able to figure out, like... And his dancers, oh my God. the most bad ones the is what they're called. Ones. They're doing charades. And then the, the super fans have to guess That's what... what it is. It, it's... It gets it gets pretty wild, you know what I mean? And that's the good thing about it. Like you can be a fan of the show, you can be a fan of the artist, and you can be somewhat unfamiliar with whoever the artist is on the episode, but you still get to get involved as a viewer sitting at yeah. home with your family on the couch or kicking it with your friends. Exactly. You'll fall in love with the artist if you're not already a fan. Or you'll fall in love with these super fans because their stories are so inspiring. Yeah. Or you'll fall in love with the competition and you'll just be like playing along at home. And, and this is a really important part that I want to make sure everyone understands. We are live voting on this show. So you have to actually watch 
after Big Brother yep. on CBS yep. and use Twitter X um, and use the hashtags that we put up on the screen because we are in, I'm in a tiny room calculating those votes <laughs> and rolling the ending that matches with that fan winning and that they're finding out in real time if they won. Yeah. That's awesome. And I love, I got to say just at the end of this, that I love how emotional they were because, and how surprised they were by some moments like Al Cool J too. And, but Shania was so emotional during a few of those moments. It was, it's great to see those things you don't get to see with them outside of, of something like this. Yeah. Listen, the assumption is that every artist has had intimate moments with their fans. But if you really think about it for a second, an artist does a concert. They might have a VIP section. Fans will come by for a meet and greet. You take a picture. You might even sign something. But there's a long line and people have to get moving. The artist has to go on to the next location and fly somewhere else for their next stop. But they don't get a chance to really sit down, listen to their stories, look them in their eyes, give a hug, really understand what that artist has meant to a super fan. That's exactly what this show provides. And that's what makes it so dope and so unique. This is different than any other show that's ever been done, not what's on TV right now. So that's why you see these moments where super fan comes up, they plead their case, or in the middle of the show, they tell a quick little story about how this artist, their songs, their movement has changed their lives. And there were times where the artist would listen, the super fan would start crying, the artist will get watery eyed, and then Kelty and I look at each other. We're like, we gotta keep it together. We gotta check our emotions <laughs> because we got a, another 45 minutes of this show to get through. Yeah. But that's what makes this show special. Name another show on TV out there like it. Go ahead. I'll wait because you can't. <laughs> <laughs> that's awesome. Well, I I hope we get more seasons. I I hope to see a spinoff because I'd love to see this applied to like I know they can't perform, but like movie. Movie we people. Talked about this. Listen, we, we talked about super this. Super fan screen. Super fan oh screen God. has to happen. It's like you, the X Men, Marvel Universe, yes. rom coms, and super, super fan sports. Super fan celebrities, even like the the Kardashians. Yeah, super fan like, like reality shows. Man, what super? We we got ideas for days. Yeah. We just need you everyone know to watch. we need them, everyone to watch so we can get the monies. So if you know yes. somebody that knows somebody that got a big bag, tell yeah. them to holler at us. We'll put on all the super fans you need. Yep. Thank you both so much for the time. Thank you. <laughs>